حالي بارلمان كي انجريز كو وحي دود كي يشين قدية دا قون سيغ سومالي لان واميد كمي ده بارلمان دا دوني دا وغوا وو دا بادان وحانا دود دا انكيني حلبان كالو يقانو غافين ويليامسان او هوري بوغاشا وغو يمي سومالي لان يسوغو اه وسير كا غاشان ديگا انجريز كا وغو هورين وحا دود دا فرين مدان ويليامسان او اخري موشين كا وكيني غولاها In 1960, Somaliland uh, emerged uh, independent from uh, the British Empire uh, after many years as the uh, uh, British Somaliland protectorate. And for five days it was independent before it took the step to... In 1960, او ايا هايد محمية انجريز كو معمولو وحي مدح بناني هاي ستي مدشن معلمودا كديب انتي آني قادن دبها اي مدني مدى كولا غشيدول كي تالياني كو قمي سنهي اي سوماليا يافين ويليامس وحوكا شيكي اي تاريخ دا سومالي لان اي مدني مدى اي لقا شي سوماليا وحوكا ورهمي بربور كي كدا شي مدني مدى اي سومالي لان لقا شي سوماليا يسوغو سي فافاسن وحوغ ورهمي تعدية دي دولة ديه سوماليا يكولا كعين شعبك سومالي لان مدة دي ومدة وغو جري يحا سوقيا يجي ستي دولة دي سياد بره And instead of there being a situation, a tragic situation of people being discriminated against from the north of Somalia in historic British Somaliland Actually what started to emerge was attacks upon civilians. There was mass killings where tens of thousands of Somalilanders were killed. Civilians were killed. It was one of a few conflicts where fighter jets took off from cities in the area in order to bomb the cities that they'd taken off from indiscriminately, killing thousands of civilians. Nomadic tribes, حيلي بان ويليامسا وحوي ساقو هادا الكيسة سي وتاعد داية مهيمة داية سومالي لان لاية ضحي هي سيداي وقتي غانو غو باهان تاهيا قوسي اي كهي شو دوني دا وحوين داها انجريز كاكو سو تشي دي اي لابد دلو سياسة داية مكاكو وچهان سومالي لان لاقانا ديغو ميل لابد دولة دود او سيمان ورا داقما سومالي لان يو سوماليا دولة دا انجريز كا ايو كو بوريه ان اي كو ديره تو غوان كا يو كوا قونسان ايسو سومالي لان ايسو غو سبابا كلا دوان رهاعي اي حلي بانا كلا او تا غيرسان موقف كا ويليامسان ايا يغونا هل كاس كا هل لاي ايو غو دمان كا شيكي اي غو لها اي سومالي لان غاد اي او يغو اي بودري غو غاد اي ان هنان كا ديمغراد يد دا اي كا هنا قاد اي ديگا ندى سومالي لان حلي بانا دا قار ايا ايا غونا بارلمان كاكيني فرريما ايو سو ديبين داد كاي متلان ايا سالهان كسو چه دا سومالي لان بلسا هاي ستادل شو ين كاين غريس كا I'm very grateful to my right honourable friend, I commend him for this debate and I'm honoured to represent a Somaliland community in Swindon just building on the points made by right honourable and honourable members about the strategic importance of Somaliland particularly the its proximity to international shipping lanes and we all know from British leadership and uh, our, our good friend the noble Lord, Lord Haig, this country led the way in dealing with the issues of piracy emanating from the Horn of Africa. Is it not now another opportunity for Britain to show leadership and to recognise stable government in a region that is in pitifully short supply of such quality? Yeah. Thank the Honourable Member for giving way and thank him for um, securing this very important debate and commend the government for the support it's been providing the administration of Somaliland. Liverpool Riverside has a very long established um, Somali community and Somalilanders and I'd like to know whether the Honourable Member will join me in calling for the UK Government to support a binding referendum within two years to allow Som Somalilanders to express their democratic will guaranteed by the international community. Thank you. I'm very grateful indeed to my right honourable friend who has brought this most important subject to the floor of the House. Can I tell him that I have visited Hargeisa when I was Secretary of State for International Development and indeed we spent quite a lot of time on exactly the issues 
he and the Chairman of the Foreign Affairs Select Committee have just raised. There is an enormous degree of normalcy there. The democratic structures, when they have elections, have held in extraordinarily difficult uh, circumstances. Um, there is proper governance. I've travelled on a bus in Hargeisa that was a result of British investment. And the case he's making about Somaliland becoming an independent state is one which the Foreign Office normally take the view that they don't want to lead it, but they would support it. But is he aware that the African Union is at least passively acquiescent in that view, if not actively supportive. The first time I was in Greece, I was in the United States of America, and I was in the United States of America. I was in the United States of America, and I was in the United States of America. I was in the United States of America, and I was in the United States of America. So I'm most grateful to my writing friend. And um, I think my writing friend makes an important point about um, leading the world, because we have seen throughout the world, that where Western nations don't get involved, China does. And when we, we've had many discussions in this House recently about the influence of China. So does my right friend agree with me, when you look at the development taking place in um, Somaliland, that actually there are strategic interests in our country and in Western countries to not just see what happens, but to actually take an active leading role and not allow that vacuum to be filled by those who perhaps we have difficulties with. On both areas that my right and wrong friend raises, uh, uh, he's absolutely right. You know, you fly into Hargeisa Airport, it, it is a safe place in order to be able to visit. You can get a bus, bus to the centre of Hargeza, as my uh, right honourable friend did. And when I visited, I, I must confess, I didn't get a, a, a bus, but uh, I will endeavour to do so next time I uh, do visit. Um, and he's equally right. You know, this is an opportunity. The Foreign and Commonwealth uh, and Development Office so often want to be led on these issues. There is a moment sometimes for Britain to lead as against to be led. Uh, I give way to uh, my right. <laughs> مقبتها ويديمو ديني اه مدونيسا موبيل كاغا ان اد كبراتو عشرة ديني اه او اف صوماليا اسلام اي فتوى وحاد كيليسا فتوى ديني اه تفسير حديث فقي سيرو لغن كسوبا دعوين سوقر فتوى اما اسلام اندر هل شن إبر